So I work for the City of Kansas City in the Office of Mayor James. My title is Special Assistant for Public Policy. I work in the areas of public health, transportation, and energy efficiency. I am responsible for making sure that the mayor is fully aware and briefed on ordinances and developments in those three areas. Quentin Savoie grew up in Kansas City. He graduated from the Paseo Academy. I am a son of Kansas City and having this job in this role is allowing me to experience the city that I love in a different way. I'm able to see the decisions that impact so many lives and make the difference in so many people's lives day to day and it just allows me to appreciate the city much differently. After high school, Quentin attended three other higher education institutions in the area and then enrolled at Metropolitan Community College. I don't think it was anything about the institution per se. There was something in me that recognized that at my core, I am a student and I like to learn. And it was something about unlocking my desire to understand my greatness and my potential that enabled my success at MCC. I knew I didn't want to go to a school where I was just another number. When I walk down the hall, I want my teacher to be able to call me by name. So whenever someone asks me about MCC, I say it's the best decision I've ever made in my life. He admits his higher education experience had a few rough patches, but says employees at MCC helped make the journey more attainable. I remember walking in August of 2008, meeting with Gwen Pate, and I walked into Penn Valley with a 1.6 GPA. And she says, okay, we can work with this. And I said, really? She said, yeah. She said, I can see that you like to write, you like history, and you like politics. After my first semester, I got all Bs and one A. That took me to, I think, a 3.25. After that first semester, my GPA allowed me to get involved in on-campus activities. And I think that is what unlocked the door to my success at MCC. I started being accountable to my peers and I was involved in the culture of the campus that enabled me to really have a support network aside from just the faculty. Dr. Craig Bartholomus and Lyle Gibson and Dr. Carrie Pickerill Brooks, those were some of the teachers that really had a hand in making sure that I was engaged, I understood the coursework. I graduated from MCC in May of 2010, and I went to Rockhurst University. Second best choice I've ever made. I can look back and say, you know what, it was all worth it. I would not have wanted to have gotten it right straight out of high school because I would not have developed the affinity for learning that I have. MCC is more than the 13th grade. 